warning. He's warning that the uh, American dream could actually be the Christian nightmare. Now, I don't go so far to say that you shouldn't work and, you know, enjoy a nice house, stuff like that. But I do I I agree with him that, you know, it's easy to get caught up in capitalism and the and making money and focusing on a on a family, you know, the focus on the family you hear so much about uh, as, a, as a Christian thing. Well, to a certain extent, yes, we should be supporting our family, but actually uh, our relationship with God should come over everything, even our family. And I'm not saying neglect the family, but starting a family and having kids and things like that should not be the first priority as a Christian. I'm getting uh, sidetracked. But uh, just be wary of the danger of ch chasing the American dream and even chasing a family and all the things we hear about in the media about how they, you know, try to market to us as Americans and American dream, things we have to have to be a good um, happy American, have to have a, two cars, a big house, a swimming pool, a boat, perfect, happy, healthy kids, everything, you know. Beware of that, because Jesus Christ comes first before all that, and if you have to give up everything for that, so be it. What's more important, the American dream or eternal life? Something to think about, my friends. That people live for. And when I say shadows, basically think about it. In the fast forward your life, another 50 years or 100 years, 